This is CNET, and here are the stories that matter right now. The head of Uber is taking a leave of absence from running the ride-hailing company. This comes right as Uber announced it is making changes to improve the workplace culture after being rocked by recent scandals and controversies, some involving sexual harassment. Uber CEO Travis Kalanick did not say when he would return to work, but his role and influence in the company is being diminished, with some duties going to a chief operating officer yet to be named. The Russian cyber attacks on the U.S. election were more extensive than previously made public, with attacks on voting systems in 39 states. That's according to a Bloomberg report. Although it doesn't appear that votes were changed, investigators found evidence of attempts to delete or alter voter data, which would have weakened confidence in the election. Verizon officially now owns Yahoo. Verizon completed its $4.48 billion purchase of Yahoo. And with that, Yahoo's president and CEO, Marissa Meyer, resigned. Verizon also owns AOL, and both Yahoo and AOL are going to be part of the media subsidiary called Oath, which also oversees more than 50 media brands, including the Huffington Post and Tumblr. Stay up to date with the latest news by downloading the CNET Tech Today app, available for iOS and Android.